Hey everyone, I'm Kristen Gerhardt and welcome to Expose. All right, let's get into the news. It's a short one this week and we begin with James Galea who was on the Late Show with Craig Ferguson this past Tuesday night slash Wednesday morning. So check your local listings on CBS to find reruns, I guess, or if you're really impatient like me, Google it. That's what I did. Also remember to tune into The Amazing Race this Sunday, 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 7 p.m. Central, to see David Copperfield make a special, magical appearance. It's gonna be awesome. I have my DVR set. <laughs> David. That's all for me this week, guys. I'm gonna head out. I'll see you next week. Sorry I was so short and sweet. I, mi I miss you already. Hey, what's up guys? Andre here, and welcome back to Expose. So this week we have a lot to discuss, so let's get started with The Wire. The first release we have is called The Longitude Change, or The Longitude Change. Let's go with Longitude Change. Uh, it's by Elmer, and it's a very creative, unique kind of way to, uh, well, color change. And it's really, really cool. It took me like three minutes worth of learning how to do this move. It's very, very easy, very simple. I'm a huge fan of those kind of moves where you don't have to practice for like months and you can just do it right away, right off the bat. Um, again, like two minutes worth of practice. Of course, put a lot more time into that uh, to practice, but super easy to learn and uh, a little bit angly, but creative and cool. So go check it out, 99 cents on the wire. The next two things we have are flourishes. The first is Shell by Daniel Hybrids. For 99 cents, you'll get a four packet rotational, flowy, smooth, very beautiful and elegant kind of a cut with a really cool and simple closer. So definitely go check it out. And the second we have is called Rolick by Sam Wheeler. Uh, Rolick is, well, it looks exactly like it sounds. It's a rolling flourish. Uh, it looks really, really cool. And while I'm not personally a big fan of the closer, uh, it's a pretty damn good value uh, free for a download and it's got great production value and you'll definitely learn something. Uh, it's got cool mechanicals to the flourish itself. So definitely go check that out. All right guys, so to make up for last week's uh, comment contest or lack thereof, uh, I think it was due to Michael James's sloth dog binge, something like that, he didn't tell me, but uh, we we're gonna do something special. So we got together with Bad Robot and uh, today at 1 p.m. Standard Pacific Time or 4 p.m. Eastern, if you're on the East Coast, uh, they're doing a giveaway on their Twitter channel. So if you're not following them already, they're producing a lot of great content. Please go do so right now at bad underscore robot and enter for a chance to win. So follow them and find out all the details on how you can win a mystery box. And I'm not just talking about one deck. I'm talking about the entire wooden box, the 100 year old reclaimed wood with the lock, with the 12 decks, with the letter pressed note from JJ Abrams, $150. Pretty epic, so uh, yeah, go follow them to find out how you can win that. Uh, really, really cool. But of course, we didn't want to leave you empty-handed, so your job this week is to also guess uh, how many cards are inside this mystery box deck. That's all. 1 to 52, how many are inside the box? And the winner will receive these awesome new black bracelets that we got in. Right here, these wristbands that you may have seen Jonathan Bain wear with him everywhere. Everywhere. I've known him for six years. I have not seen him take it off once. So uh, they're really cool. They've got the logo on the front and in the back and uh, really cool and sleek. So yeah, represent. That was actually Jonathan Bain, no lie. He was calling to ask... All right, that was actually JB. Uh, he calls every time you mention his name. It's very weird. He's got this psychic mental thing about him. I don't know what it is, but never fails. So last week we got a few comments asking where Zach Mueller was and actually JB and Zach just spoke on the phone and figured everything out. Everybody is happy. Zach is pursuing his personal interests, personal projects he's very, very passionate about. And if you wanna follow that story some more, click the link in the description below to follow that. But in short, in summary, everybody's happy, everybody's cool, and everybody's friends. So, with that said, we will leave you guys. Kristen, Michael, myself, and Charmander will see you guys next week.